I don't think it's going to break, honestly. I'll watch. NVIDIA bounced from 366 to 380 That's a $15 bounce. That's a, that's a humongous big cap. AMTX. Uh, looks like BMR is just going to sell off or come back down. I don't know. I made one trade today. I'm just slowly. I don't know. I don't know. I'm just not into the flow of things. I'm just not fighting. I'm just sitting. I've been doing this for like two days now. I don't know. I just stopped. I'm on a. I'm on a two day, do nothing. Uh, yesterday then do much and today I took one trade I took a good trade on it it just came back down and I said forget it obviously I should have taken a second trade on it I have like really low patience with these tickers I'm like if it doesn't work I'm like ah oh, there's always tomorrow why would I stress myself out Mark is gonna be here forever 365 a year a day. <gasps> WLDS trying to break a dollar. Is it going to break or die? WLDS. Let's see. How, how do we break a dollar? Dun, dun, dun. Let me see. I think it's going to reject a dollar. Looks like a round number there. I think the dollar chasers are going to get. Or maybe the dollar chasers are going to buy. The dollar chasers bought. Okay. It's going now. We broke pre-market highs just now. Where do we go now? 125? The dollar chasers We go to 125 or just die off. Oh, oh, that's 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 we we hit that pre-market high. We broke it by a couple pennies. Do we keep going or we die? Volumes coming in, 1.2 million. Let's see it break 105. Does it break 105? There's 105, WLDS. 106, 109, 110. Looks like the buyers are here on this one. Holy smokes, it's halting up. <laughs> WLDS, huge halted. The dollar buyers came in. Really strong. Next resistance WLDS is like 125. I'm in halt in W. Congrats, congrats. It's probably gonna go to 120. Jack is doing two for twos in WLDS. Two for twos is good. WLDS halted resume time is nine. 53 halted 948 unhalt 953 see we got some brave people here today the brave people are showing up everybody everybody else is not so brave i think i think for the past two weeks we watched these tickers not break high of the day and now these tickers are breaking high of the day and we're like well, I'm I'm a little bruised up because I was trying to buy them for the past two weeks, and now they're finally going, and I'm just hesitating. I have I have uh, you know most people have uh, you know performance anxiety. <laughs> <laughs> eh, it's gonna eventually just wear off on you.
WLDS ripping here. NA. NA? What is NA doing? Today is Thursday, so usually it starts out weak, and then they buy it, and then it goes up super strong, and then they sell it. That's kind of like how it works. WLDS. <sighs> Dollar buyers are here. Welcome to Thursday. This is kind of like how Thursday trade. This is how Thursday ticker trades. Thursday tickers usually chop you out. I think I think a lot of shorts are short WLDS, and a lot of shorts are short BMR. So Thursday trades very. Up and downish. AMTX. There's 750. BMR. There's ooh eight dollars. Ooh, that's nasty. Ooh, and a hard rejection. Ouch. BMR can't do eight. We had an algal spike and a death in BMR. That looks nasty. That looks like a topish behavior. That's what topish behavior looks like. When you see those algo spikes like that. BMR. Topish behavior. You see those algo spikes to 8. And back down to six, 675. Yeah, you know that the top is near. Or maybe that's the top. It's called. So. BMR um, WLDS should on hold 9.53 so let's see resistance for WLGS is 1.23 so WLDS resistance is 1.23 on the daily we're about to on hold we got 120, 125 WLDS on the bid that's impressive about to on halt at 9.53. Resistance is 125 WLDS. Let's see WLDS on halt and maybe it'll hit 120. WLDS. There's 120. There's 120. High is 126. There's 125. 124. 125. Do we, have, do we get a secondary halt? Do we break 125 or reject? Yeah, that's a daily resistance. Because I, I was looking to, sh to short sell that. I was looking to short. This is this is, this is is short the daily resistance pattern. I mean, that is a short the daily resistance. Uh, BMR went straight back down. <coughs> oh my god, too early. Yeah, welcome to trading. Uh, NA. NA is just pushing their VWAP reclaim. Look at these stocks just do VWAP reclaims and squeeze shorts out. Today is definitely a squeeze the shorts out day. Let's see. WLDS. 132 next resistance we hit 132 next resistance 145 next resistance 190 i don't know how high this thing can go but i definitely don't want to short anything that has apple and and uh you know this is the reason i don't short things that have apple and uh nvidia 
in the news. There's the strongest pattern like this. WLGS breaks a dollar, hits 130. And you have BMR. It had a daily, that had an intraday breakout of five, 550, ran to seven. So that's, there's the reason why I don't short these things. Because it has key, uh, key ingredients. Key ingredients are Apple and NVIDIA in the news. When I see that, I'm not pushing the short button. And I'm not that great of a buyer. I have anxiety. I'm not that great of a buyer. Don't look at me. I sell my longs way too soon. I have problems of my own. I make a lot more money when the cycle turns. When you have all these craps that are going up on no news. And they're gapping up 200%. That's when I like to come in. Right now the longs are having a field day. Oh, 135. Holy smokes. WLDS. I mean, things should soon get out of hand here. WLDS. 135 hit there for a minute. It's starting to become overextended. But you just never know how high these things will go. With Apple and... Apple in the news. Apple is like the biggest company on earth. It is the biggest company on the planet. You don't want to short something that says Apple. It will. Especially a low float. That's a 10 milli float. That's a low float. WLDS. The biggest company in the world, I think, is Apple. Second, is it the second comp most most profitable company. I don't know. Is it Toyota? <laughs> Top companies on earth. This is where the course comes in. This is why you gotta get over, get get through the course, because because this is a great lesson to learn here. NA Top companies in the world is Apple Apple company 394 billion then is Google then is Berkshire Hathaway Amazon Berkshire Hathaway has like 300 billion that is probably half of it that billion is invested in <laughs> in Apple Johnson & Johnson, Walmart, Microsoft, Alphabet. Now we're halting up. WLDS halt. Uh, yeah, welcome to trading. 
I'm not that good at my longs. I'll show you what's moving, but I'm not that good at my longs. I'll be honest with you. Most amount of money is just most amount of money I make is through my shorts. I you you know these things don't happen that often, but when they do, they're just a nightmare for short sellers. So that's why you gotta buy it and hold. Maybe buy it with small size. It does. LL. Son. BMR, look at that. Hard rejection of the eights and death. Hard rejection of the eights and death. WLDS is actually easy to short, b believe it or not. And that's easy to short. Everybody wants to short stock that has Apple next to it. I guess NA. shorts are just going to die off today. There you go. BMR selling off hard after that hard candle. L I Z I
Lizi Tisi LEDs PRSO Ive. WLDS. All right, we are back. Looks like the longs are winning pretty pretty strong today. <sighs> I've WLDS. Well, it's getting up there. I think it's just going to kill the shorts today on this one. Shorts are toast. I don't know. Next resistance WLDS is like two bucks. One ninety four now the resistance is. 
Jesus. Ain't no stopping WLDS. Son. WLDS halted ten eleven. Next on halt time is ten sixteen. It's been pretty bullish for today. Yesterday, I th I think, wasn't that bullish. <sighs> I think yesterday was not. ICM. IZM, what's IZM? Who knows IZM now? BMR pops up on the support line. NA, KVNT, TC. Yeah, it looks like you looks like this bull cycle you should hold your longs longer. This bull cycle holds your longs longer. Anything over 20% is a home run trade. This ticker 70 cents up to 150. This ticker did a lot of range here for those that traded WLDS. I think I should have bought it. Like VWAP reclaim here. I, I saw the whole thing. Like VWAP here at VWAP reclaim at 80 cents would have been like your ideal long there. That would have been your ideal long there. Now it's just uh, way up there. It will be nice if we had these, these every day back to back. I mean, yesterday we had one in the pre-market. And... Uh, It's been Son. very interesting to trade because one day they're running back up and the other day it's a gap up short. So it's been a really mixed bag of these things. One day we're going to the moon. The other day we're gapping up and we're going kamikaze style. IZM. So IZM now. I mean, WLDS is going to be interesting stock to take that short. I don't know where is it going to go, but it's getting up there. It's getting up there into the 180s, $2 area. I mean, how many times do you see a stock up 500%? WLDS. Ooh, a gap down. 
Oh, that's terrible. Looks like that's the end of it. LL. A gap down after the halt. Yeah, that's the end of it. WLDS. 150. We had a gap down into a halt. Oh, I mean, shorts are definitely. Um, I mean, we had a gap down after the halt, a dip buy, and now we're back up to highs. Oh, wow. Now we're going, what, to 190? 194? <laughs> it's not the end of it. Yikes. A gap down, a dip buy, and a rip through highs. <laughs> of course, trading is easy. Dun -dun -dun. WLDS. I'm sure I'm sure shorts are drooling at this stock to short it, but it says has Apple on it. So I'm sure they're gonna not trade it. Alright, two ticker move today. It's about to ten thirty and I'm about to take a nap. It was fun trading with you guys. Um I, I didn't make much. I just I just traded some BMR. I don't know. It's just I'm I'm trying to get my my fighting stance in, but I'm still um, I'm still I'm still like I don't know. I'm no, not no. I'm not in the groove. I don't know why. It's just I'm just I don't know. I'm not in the groove. I'm looking at these tickers and just. I mean, I tried to buy BMR. I had the right idea to buy BMR. Unfortunately. I was buying it here. I had a huge gain here. I had about, I don't know, I think it was a thousand bucks here or something. And um, I actually did buy some 520s. I was not locking in profits. That's my problem in BMR. I didn't lock in profits. And then I looked at WLDS and I'm like, well, that should be the end of it. I looked at WLDS and I just didn't want to chase. Because those things don't happen that often. A VWAP reclaim and a high of the daybreak and, uh, you know, all this absurdity doesn't happen every day. So when it does, it's just a big surprise to the short sellers. Other than that, make sure you tune in tomorrow. I mean, I thought I was going to trade more. I just watch and I watch and I watch. But the shorts, the, the longs are definitely winning. Whew. I'm just taking it slow.